Hi everybody, I'm Ty Moser and this is the Mono Local Workshop. I recently took a trip to Idaho to visit my parents and my father was kind enough to let me bring his 6 inch joiner home. I've done a little research and this thing is from the late 50s to early 60s. It's not the prettiest looking thing but it is sturdy as can be and with a little TLC this thing will be running great and it'll be doing a lot better than my old 4 inch joiner that I got. Um, the frame, I was originally going to change the frame, make it wooden, kind of like my rolling shop carts, but I really don't have the time. I'm getting a little bit busy, I'm getting ready to buy a new house and move, so I used the original frame, I added some more supports, and I added a mobile base. Really what I wanted to show in this video is just how easy it is to make this mobile base and how cheap it was. I'm gonna wrap the bottom with the two by four, uh, around all the corners and bolt it right to the legs. And then I went and picked up some small uh, door hinges and uh, I have some conduit that's just been laying around forever. So I'm gonna put some hinged, uh, I'm gonna put the wheels on some hinged two by four and uh, kind of make a support in the middle. Um, there, I mean, there's a couple different videos for end results where I got the idea. I will put them in the comments. <laughs> This is going to be one of the sections that have the wheels attached to the bottom that flips down and locks. I'm going to chisel enough of this out so this will be fully recessed. I'll just cut down to that line I scored on either side. I cut these two small pieces out of some scrap plywood and I'm going to glue them together and I'm going to use them later as the latch. I'm going to just put this cross member in here and on top of this I'm going to put a little, basically a little latch out of that plywood I glued earlier and then have the bar come out and just latch right onto that. So each of the boards with the feet get a hole drilled for the pipe, uh, offset it from the center, uh, one's on one side, one's on the other, so then when we put them on there we can put a little toggle bolt kind of in the middle. So I'll just cut that out on the bandsaw real quick and drill a bolt hole down through it. Undo the bottom two and then it drops down and it's nice and solid on the ground and it's not going anywhere. If you want to make it mobile, you really just kind of bend the pipe around, clamp it up, and there you go. It's mobile, it moves around. Thanks for watching, and if you've enjoyed my video, please subscribe, thumbs up, and comment below.